he got into model airplanes, which, and they were free flights. Small engine, gas engine, and then it would run for about three minutes. So we'd go out to these open, wide open fields, and then you'd start at the engine, let it go, and it'd go in a circle, and climb up, up, you know, as high as it go, and they'd run out of gas, and then it would glide back down again. Try to get as long a flight as you could out of it. And I remember one time where his plane went up there, and it was gliding down, and it caught a thermal, and it just kept drifting downwind, so we kind of ran across it went, actually went out of sight, and we lost it. But he was wow. delighted. Yeah. For him, that was a successful fight because it, it, it flew away. Now, when I was in 15, uh, in Fim and I took uh, uh, flying lessons. With, uh, there was a glider airport there. So I kind of knew basics of aviation. So when he showed me the pictures of this Michael, I, I thought, man, this, I don't like this thing. It looked really unsafe, mm -hmm. and it was it was unsafe. And he sort of talked to me and wanted to know if I wanted to get into it also. And I said, "Well, you know, not not this thing." But it was a great thing for him. It was the, the, the mic. It was like because you get afford it, you could take off out of a, a little field, and it's just it was like freedom. It was just like he was becoming a model airplane that flew away. <laughs>